What's up guys? Nick with the Brando Unboxing video and slight like update update on Let's Plays and stuff like that. But uh you know, let's get to that really quick. It's getting it's gonna get to the point where I'm not gonna be able to record anything like ever because I'm either gonna be too tired to talk or do anything or I just won't be have the mood to do it. So after Thanksgiving, recordings will come back. Let's just do that. So basically what date would that be? Let's go with the 30th of, uh, 30th of November. I'll come back with some Let's Plays. I might record something Thursday or Tuesday or something because that's the only day I'm off. But other than that, there aren't going to be any Let's Plays until after Thanksgiving because that's the, bu that's the busy week. That's when I'm going to be so tired out I'm not going to want to do anything. So anyway, let's get to what we're here for. The real reason why we're here. real reason why y'all pressed play on this video, went to my channel and looked at it. Pokemon Super Mystery Dungeon. Y'all might have watched two of my Let's Plays of it. There might be a third one down the line. Who knows when. <clears throat> I've, record, I've recorded the first two games. I love them to death. You know, near the end, I start getting like, okay. But, I really do like the Mystery Dungeon series. I played all but that third game. And Gase of Infinity was kind of like a little lackluster because you didn't have like all the Pokemon up to that point. This one, this one, you have everybody. You have every single Pokemon in this game. In this little tiny cartridge here. But anyway. <laughs> I, like, I like the cover. I just now noticed that. Look on top of Charizard. You have War Turtle and Bulbasaur. You have everyone else down there. It's all the starters. And some of their evolutions. Some of their popular evolutions. Like, uh... Uh, Finnegan's evolution, uh, Sni Snivy's evolution, uh, Infernape's on there, so he's the final evolution. You know, you have some of the final evolutions, and then you have all the basic ones that people love the most. You know, I think it's pretty. I think it's pretty cool. There, I hope you get to choose who you can be. If it's still a quiz thing, that's fine. I'm gonna cheat to get the one I want to be. I want to be this one right here, right beside Pikachu. That's a Riolu. Why? Because I actually like Riolu and Lugario. So, don't hate on me for that. Alright, let's get to what we're supposed to be doing here. The Definitive Pokemon Mystery Dungeon Game. Become a Pokemon. Go on adventures and save the world. All 720 species of Pokemon. Are they really species, though? Because if that's the case, wouldn't, like, a Squirtle be a species? But his evolution will be a part of his species, so technically that's one, not three. Uh, an unknown peril in the world of Pokemon? An unknown peril in the world of Pokemon is a question. Go on adventures and rescue, mi and rescue missions. Make friends with every Pokemon. Batter your way through dangerous dungeons. Use alliance attacks. What? Alliance attacks. You get to joint attack. Finally. Power up with Mega Evolutions. Which... Hopefully they let you evolve whenever you're supposed to. And not, you know, wait till the end of the game. So, that's what I'm hoping. And the last one. Rescue other players or call for help. Let's check the back. This is all the pictures and stuff. Just do whatever. Rated E for mild, what does it say? Mild cartoon violence. So basically just attacking. But I'm looking forward to this one. When I saw the commercial, I had to look it up. It said uh, playable on new 3DS. I'm like, oh, don't you dare. No, it's not just for new 3DS. It's also for the regular 3DS and for the 2DS, of course. Playable in 2D and 3D. Usually when they say that, it means it's not 3D heavy. Okay, I'm not going to get this anymore. Did I cut it? Yeah, I cut it. There it is. But, I don't have many 3DS games for some odd reason. The, the base, Basically, the only games I really get for it are Pokemon games or Yu-Gi-Oh games, and they don't have that many Yu-Gi-Oh games out for it, so... Actually, I, don't, I think the only one I have is the Zexel game. Where you get to either do a little campaign of your own of, like, regular whatever characters. Anyway. Wow, that's basic. What is this? Really? 
download a demo version of oh dude that's pretty cool it gives you a theme what is this download a, s a demo version of Omega Ruby and Alpha Sapphire my bad but then it gives you a free Super Mystery Dungeon theme for your 3DS that's actually pretty neat I'll just do this that's what it's supposed to be. That looks pretty cool. I had the code on the other side, so I'm not showing it. But I'm going to get it. Mine is actually an Espeon and Umbreon. <laughs> My two favorite evolutions, basically. Alright. Here's the cart. Or, uh, card. Cart. I don't know. That's what it is. So, I'm hoping this game is as good as... I mean, Gates of Infinity was good. But it took away so many Pokemon, it was like, eh. And then it gave you a legendary, like, almost, like, two hours into the game. So... Let's not give me an end to at the beginning. Okay, guys? Thank you. So, thank you for watching this episode. I will see you on possibly Tuesday, if not after Thanksgiving. And then, you know, the week of Christmas, probably none either. But we'll see. So, see you later.